Uh, my name is uh, Jürgen, I'm from Norway. And my name is Amy, and I come from China. Uh, I'm Jung, I'm from Vietnam. My name, my name is Ross, and I'm from Ireland. My name is Eleonora, I'm from Israel. Um, I chose Hungary because I had a really good recommendations about the medical school. Hungary has been a member of the European Union since 2004. This European community provides a solid base for the peaceful development of all its member states, including Hungary. Hungary has a population of close to 10 million people. The capital, Budapest, is a busy metropolis and one of Europe's favorite cities with its beauty, sights, bustling cultural life and friendly people. The life is very good in Budapest. You know? It's a very easy, easy going way. The, the, the people are really kind. <laughs> Budapest is also one of Europe's cultural centers with its international cultural institutions. Many of the world's best scholars hold their forums here. Internationally renowned musicians and performers appear on Budapest stages, while its exhibition halls attract thousands of visitors every year. There's a good um, cafe culture here also in the city, you know. Yeah, There's yeah. lots of nice cafes where you can relax and uh, it's just a good feel to the city, you know. It's a very safe place. I've never seen any trouble on the streets in three years, you know. That uh, you can, it's safe walking home or anything, you know. It's a very good city, you know. It's everybody's friendly when you get out, you know. And uh, you meet a lot of nice girls. <laughs> you some good places and get some dance on and everything. That's cool. It's so much better to go out here than in Norway. Hungarian higher education has a long history. The first university was founded in 1367. Hungarian scientists have contributed significantly to international scientific work. And for this reason, there is a high regard and considerable pride in Hungarian scientific achievements. Thirteen Nobel Prize winning scholars have pursued their education in Hungary. In addition, it is worth mentioning those famous Hungarians who invented the match, the ballpoint pen, and the helicopter, and the long string of famous conductors, painters, artists, such as Zoltán Kodály, Béla Bartók, and Victor Vazarelli. Also of note is the great national poet, Sándor Petrofi, and the world-famous sporting personalities, such as the legendary Ferenc Puskás. In the field of informatics, the outstanding achievements of Janusz Neumann, mathematician and father of the modern computer, and Charles Simoni, head of the Microsoft software group that created Windows, Excel, and Word programs, deserve appreciation. Semmelweis University looks back on the past of several hundred years, being founded in 1769. Its campuses are scattered around the heart of the capital. It has five faculties with a total of 8,000 students. The Faculty of Health Sciences provides internationally renowned programs and competitive diploma for healthcare professionals. Atlantis is a EU-US pilot program. It's a world-leaning dual degree program for bachelor nursing. Um, the students studying at Budapest is open to a variety of possibilities. Not only do they get to meet with um, different colleagues from different um, areas, different countries, but also the student is, uh, has a chance to participate in exchange programs. Uh, Semmelweis has links with universities throughout Europe, but also with Rochester in uh, the United States. And so students can participate in exchanges, as can the staff. The grant was won by the Semmelweis University Faculty of Health Sciences, the Nazareth College, and the Laurea University of Applied Sciences, Finland. Students are educated by 200 instructors and several reputed external lecturers. In addition, the faculty has an ever-increasing portfolio of courses. Training at the Faculty of Health Sciences is credit-based and multi-level. Students begin with basic training, which culminates in the award of a bachelor's degree in their specific field. This enables them to start work immediately while continuing their studies in the second level, the master's program. The doctoral or PhD level is the third stage of training. The Faculty of Health Sciences offers programs at all three levels. In this way, it ensures lifelong learning. Students can gain diplomas within three basic programs. They can graduate as nurses, dietitians, physiotherapists, paramedics, or midwives in the nursing and patient care basic program, as health visitors or public health inspectors in the healthcare and prevention basic program, 
and as optometrist or as diagnostic imaging analyst in the medical laboratory and diagnostic imaging basic program. Teachers are all very highly qualified, but they all have a very strong practical background, and I think it's very important in this issue. You get a lot more attention from the teachers than you would normally, you know. In my class, for example, there was only uh, 15 students, so everybody could get a lot of attention from, this, from, the, from the teachers, you know, and uh, you could help your study if you needed any, anything, you know. Teaching foreign students uh, really keeps you at the edge of your game um, because you're, you're, not, you're teaching to someone who doesn't know how things are in your country. And so students, foreign students are more likely to question why things are done. And it makes you think about your practice and ensure that your practice is evidence-based. So it brings a new look to the subject that perhaps you've taught many, many times before. I think uh, multiple cultural, yeah. It's, uh, it's very important for the study stuff um, because uh, you sometimes you will argue, of course, because the students together, we are kids, we're making fun, we argue about the question, and uh, from the argument you can find um, like uh, the will of they are seeing the world because uh, we are not perfect and uh, we can learn about from each other. Semmelweis University is the largest of the institutes involved in training doctors and healthcare professionals in Hungary. It attracts the most foreign students coming to study in Hungary. To date, close to 2,000 students have attained their diplomas through the English and German language training programs offered at Semmelweis. The high level of training plus the relatively low tuition fees and low living expenses is a significant factor for prospective students. Anyone interested in training at the Faculty of Health Sciences can participate in a one-year-long preparatory course which is aimed at improving language and professional skills. Most because it, uh, the Hungarian language is difficult. Really, I study Hungarian about one year, but uh, I cannot speak a lot, uh, a little bit. The faculty is prepared for students with its fully equipped modern classrooms, laboratories, lecture hall, computer rooms and public library. Students have the possibility of getting comfortable accommodation at a favourable price in the faculty's two residence halls. They also have a wide range of sporting and cultural options, including handball, basketball, soccer and aerobics. And I went here because I used to skate, a roller skate, and uh, I thought they don't have those kind of groups. But I found out that... that um, European people also like sports. They do skate a lot, and they have hockey, skates, and basketball every, everywhere. And uh, uh, we used to skate every, every week on Friday, Friday night at the square. An exciting student life and an inspiring study environment are waiting for students arriving at the Faculty of Health Sciences at Semmelweis University. I like Budapest, and uh, I would like to work here. So I hope I, uh, I will better Hungarian language and I will uh, live here for work. I will work as a physio. If I get a chance, I will work here in, Bud in Budapest. If not, I will work at home, you know. But uh, I don't think uh, that Hungary is uh, for me to work. I think I'm going to stay in Europe definitely. I don't think I'm going back home. But uh, I'm just waiting for open doors to see what's the opportunities for me. If I finish the bachelor degree, I want to learn the master and uh, to be work as a physio. If I have a chance to work here, it's fine for, for me to work here. Finish with studying, I have a better opportunity to work in different countries. And uh, I heard about this school. It has a really good reputation in Norway. Uh, a lot of people have studied here in Solomon's. And they all come out with uh, good jobs. Uh, and so far, it's looking really good. I'm really happy with this school. It's a great city, so I'll definitely come back. But I don't think I'm going to work here. No.